Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I have got a B&M come shop with me and haul for October 2021. I asked you guys over on my little like YouTube community page. I did a little poll to see what video you guys would like to see and you chose a B&M one, which I was really, really happy about. The last time I went into B&M was a couple of weeks ago, um, prior to this video. And there was some Christmas stuff, but there wasn't a huge amount. And the last B&M haul that I did, I'll link it down below. I remember saying to you guys that I really, really wanted to film and share it but I just felt like September was slightly too early for that it's like Halloween spooky season and I love that I definitely felt like it was right to show the Christmas stuff I had like four aisles of Christmas stuff and I was so excited um, and I have definitely come out with a big bag full of stuff which I can't wait to share with you I will 100% be doing more B&M come shop with me as and home bargains pound land the range things like that a little bit closer to Christmas as they start getting more and more stuff in I think I said in the video in the come shop with me clips that you'll see in a minute but I do feel like B&M is definitely ahead of the game of Christmas this year. Home Bargains literally has like half an aisle. If you are new, please do click that subscribe button because it's so lovely to have you here. I think as it stands, I'm three subscribers away from 2k, which is like beyond exciting. So yeah, it would be lovely for you guys to join with me and join in with all of my Christmassy winter content that's going to come. But without further ado, let's head to B&M and let's see what's in there. Oh look, they've got these things from Christmas. Like last year, like they're, they're cool for hampers and stuff. And then we've just spotted down here, we've got more of the skinny sauces that you guys know I love. I actually got sent some, but it's quite cool now you can get them in here. I've been buying them in here for a really long time and in home bargains. So I grab all the time, I literally love it. So it's the Mayflower curry sauce. I don't know if I've ever really talked about it on my channel before, but it's really good if you're trying to eat healthy because you literally just add water to it, like in a pan, and it makes a really nice tasting curry sauce. Also, if you can hear. <laughs> anything it's probably the rain outside because it's absolutely peeing it down these cool like dairy milks it's like caramel birthday cake like a mint one there what's that one up there oh terry's chocolate orange white bar there's a bit of me that looks really nice actually we've got some like christmasy gift sets as well what's here squashies bath bombs bath crumble my boyfriend literally loves squashies but he is obsessed so again, this is like a really good stocking thing for him. Occasionally, he does watch my videos, so I'm a little bit worried if I pick it up, they'll know. But I do think that is really cool for £4, actually. Good for like a secret Santa gift or something. <laughs> really cool up here as well. They've got like Revolution sets, which I feel like they've been doing for a few years in here. I think that's really, really cool that they do it because it makes it so much more affordable. Oh, what are these? Coffee toppers. And they come with like a little stencil. Oh, Cinnamon, vanilla, chocolate. Oh, I love it. Favourite time of year always. I love Christmas time. Lucky Charms hot chocolate. They've got loads of Costa as well, which I feel like these are relatively new. They're like little pod ones. Ghost cake. Oh my God. That is, oh, oh thank you. <laughs> I love a meringue. I don't even know how you make a meringue. I think it's like egg and, oh my God. <laughs> I can't deal with this. They've got like Christmassy crisp and popcorn here, which I remember from last year, they brought them back. It says pig and blanket honey glazed ham which sound insane i don't remember these from last year and then they've got turkey and stuffing just spotted these down here which look quite cool they look very new so they're milk chocolate covered honeycomb bites and they actually look really expensive and they're only a pound which i think is quite nice we've got mini chocolate orange crispy oranges it's quite a lot of new chocolate out at the minute actually i don't know if it's like christmas time and they're bringing all the new stuff out we've got like chocolate sundaes and like sweet sundaes up along there oh mike and ike cotton candy Both these just look a dream like i've never seen these in here before i might get these again for like a stocking filler for a pound i think they look really really cool but these like, it's like a little small set as well which just makes me feel so christmassy movie night inbox we've got m m dispensers which i remember buying one of these from m, &M world in london like probably like five ten years ago now and i literally spent like 30 quid on it so the fact they got a mini one for 2.99 is a bargain but also kind of hurts me a little bit <laughs> Wicked treats scented Halloween sake. What's this one? Scary berry. I love them. That's what I love anything themed. Even these, like little hand gels for a pound. Strawberry scented. What's this one? Oh, they're all strawberry. <laughs> I've got a coffee feeling they're all going to be strawberry. Yep, all strawberry scented. But I love this one. Like the little thing of it. Just like a little stuff and filler. Little secret Santa gift. Really, really nice. Oh, what are these? M and M high protein chocolate. Do you remember the cakes you used to get yes. in the mill deal, the M&M cakes? 
<laughs> they were really nice. I don't think they do them anymore, but they were nice. Or they got like chocolate brownie, sort of caramel cookies and cream, a bunch of different ones. We were trying to keep an eye out for the like fake Smarties that they do, but they've not had them in here for a while, but they are so nice. Another quite cute like secret Santa gift. We've got gingerbread mix and cut a kit, which is really good for 149. Just having a little eye up of all the little wicker baskets and stuff, and they're all really cheap. I think these ones are really, really good for five pounds. I'm actually tempted to grab one of these and like put someone's like Christmas gifts in it or something. They're really nice. I love this one as well. How much is that one? Ten pound. They've got like a white one for ten pound. It's all so nice. Oh, look at these like glittery fake flowers. Oh, yeah, that's what I had. Oh my God, look. Little succulents. We're down like kind of the Christmassy mm. aisle, kind of home aisle, but I really like that. For five pound, I think that's really nice. We've got like mini ones here. They've got Christmassy ones, frosted berry ones. Oh, I love it all. We've got a little giraffe one down there. Again, I feel like these are good. As like little stocking fillers they've got gingerbread cookie which i think the packaging looks really nice and it opens up as well so you can smell it that actually does smell really really nice they've got tea lights reed diffusers a couple of other like scents and stuff and then this which we've just been obsessing over i think this is new i don't remember mm. seeing this last year but it's like a gingerbread outline they've also got christmas tree oh look at these kayla seasons greetings they've got little random pom-poms on it and then they've got more of like reed diffusers wax melts a bunch of different wax burners as well which i always feel like is a good gift to get especially these like marbly ones down here over in this home section we've got like fake pampas grass which is literally everywhere i remember it's so hard to get your hands on like fake pampas grass and now i see it everywhere um but they've got that one they've got like a cute little tea light holder for three pound which is actually really cute over here we've got some like big chunky throws some more kind of like christmasy decorations like antlers we've got like a candle holder how nice does this look oh, yeah, for three pound oh i really like this wax burner as well again it's kind of like that speckly material only trouble is i find my wax burners get so dirty like so quickly and i always have to clean them really quickly but i do really like that or like hanging moon hanging shelf fake plant more small kind of wax burners tea light holders lots of like little metallic bits metallic plate beautiful like dream catcher gatsby metallic print fro i love anything gatsby like great gatsby style 1920s i really really like so i think that's a really nice gift they got like faux fur pillows with these glitter tea lights these frames are lovely as well kind of like a faux velvet material those of like reefs i think this one's really pretty over here as well hanging mirrors more kind of metallic throws i think you can't go wrong for a throw in here to be honest i've got so many from here before because they're actually quite nice quality it's a really nice little candle as well what's that bamboo and cherry blossom we've got <laughs> tree skirts they've got a bunch of tree skirts over there hampers but do you see what i mean when i say that like actual hampers are a lot of money like christmas ones when you can just get like a nice storage basket and make your own which is definitely what i think i'm going to do but they've got kind of oh these are cute actually little stockings basically i do a stocking with my boyfriend and i do one with my sister um and i'm gonna be doing the same this year oh look at these like christmasy mugs i love that space for a cookie little plates as well there's like a little Christmas tree shaped plate, which is so nice. This whole aisle literally just excites me so much. They've got like a Tassimo set. Oh, what are these? Coffee set, like Christmas. Mint, Irish cream, cinnamon, gingerbread. Shortbread, we've got like loads of chocolate on this side. We do gift sets in any firm, like gravy granules. <laughs> Massive shortbread thing up there as well. Got a bunch of, oh, Bailey's fudge chocolate twists up there they've got like chocolate dipping sets football popcorn loads of baby stuff actually oh, they got mini guinness that's funny mini mix sweets oh i love that that's such a nice little gift idea drumsticks smarties munchies over here there's like kind of more crisp stuff that millions thing's really cool and more of like the alcoholic ones like this cracking gift set i think is ideal they've got beer ones 
beefy at gym with like a really lovely glass that's really nice they've got a little candle one there rum one. Oh look mini gingerbread house how cute is that look look all this personalized stuff again it's all in that kind of like fake velvety material i love like the like emeraldy green one what else have they got little notebooks drink bottles oh these are what i really wanted last year what, and hint hint no one got me one yeah but they're only baby ones yeah i know but like for a stocking i think they're nice <laughs> hint hint <laughs> on this as well a little candle with it comes with a, like a little wooden tray these look cute as well these like little moonlight lamps look at these look dog socks four pack <laughs> again that's a cute gift oh i like that as well look and they've all got like party hats on a little drinking bottle dog tea towels oh and like milestone cards so like you like take a picture of them when, like you know like they do for oh, babies. Yeah, babies so look i can fetch I made today I made friends today I learned to bark <laughs> over this side we got a bunch of like lynx sets again and then there's more kind of like skincare stuff here there's like mario bath bombs these like cupcake bath bombs if I was little I would have literally loved these like little love heart perfumes we've got like slush puppy gift sets Jurassic world because you guys know I love a bit of dinosaur all really good stuff I, I actually after going in both I feel like B&M is definitely winning on the Christmas department. Home bargains don't actually have that much in at the minute. Yeah, like they've got a bunch of fra Oh my God, look at these. I know, I did see those. Pet more dogs, drink more water and dog lover. If I was moving out, this would be a bit of me. They've also got these over here. Little 101 Dalmatians. Oh my God, and this water bottle as well. With like... Disney dogs, I think that's like a bit of me. They're dogs on their Disney. Disney princesses glasses. They've got a bunch of like friend stuff up here as well. Clean like Monica tea towel, which is quite cool. We've got glasses, notebooks. Gift sets as well, there's so many. Ah, bourgeois. They don't even sell that anymore. Mm. It's kind of cool, it's like a gift set. Look, originally £45. That's really nice, actually. I love these as well, these little makeup brushes. Oh. I think they look really nice just because of what's inside. they got loads of stuff, and then they got a bunch of, like, revolution sets as well down there. See, this is where I get excited, yeah, because I love all this stuff, especially all these designs this year. Like, they're all so pretty. Like, little mini gift bags. I might even get some and put them away. Like, I love these designs. They're really nice. I love this one as well, actually. Definitely going to pick some up, I think. I really like these ones. Like, this design. I've also got that one in there. I feel like it is still quite early, but it's the sort of thing that I do where I put them away. And I, towards Christmas, trust me, getting hold of gift tags is bloody hard. So, I'm definitely going to get some. They've also got a bunch of different designs over on this side as well, which I really like. Um, like, these ones here, I think, are, like, stunning. Like, really, really nice colors and things so i might get some of these we've got these like snowflake sparkle christmas sparkle like they all just look so nice and like the gift tags and stuff mini little gift bags i literally love it all so much i like that wrapping paper as well I don't think I'll get the boxes. No, that's one thing I'm actually going to say. Yeah, the boxes were a bit of a letdown. I got yeah, really excited I, yeah. over them. Um, but <laughs> to tell you the truth, the quality was really crap. Um, and they broke and I had to keep sellotaping them. And they were basically just a bunch of aggro guys. So I would probably stick with the gift bags if I were you. Um, I do, don't get me wrong, feel like they look nice. Um, but practicality wise, they just were not the one. Um, so I'm definitely going to be sticking with the gift bags, I think, this year look all these like christmas ribbons as well oh don't you just love decorating like I, I am actually excited to do it all this year they've got so many nice ones i've filled well actually can't really see but i filled my basket with a bunch of like different bags and stuff and look at all of these baubles didn't we get loads of new baubles last year i feel like we got a few but i really like like the more colorful ones like these green blue there's like purple little like feather boa decorative ones Oh, there's another little actual feather bow there. <gasps> Look at all these pink ones. How cute. What's that, like, little tea light? Oh, no, it lights up, but that's quite cool. Bows. I love the reindeer in the 
things there. What are they? Oh, I really like feather bears. Not on trees, but I, I do like them at Christmas. I think they're quite nice. But those are like floral stuff. This side, they've just got a bunch of other more decorative stuff, like hangy, more sort of like hangy stuff. Cute. What the little houses? Yeah. yeah, they are good for ten pound actually. Oh look, little sleigh. Oh my god, they've got even more. They have loads of their Christmas stuff out. Mm. I didn't expect that at all. Literally, what I live for at this time of year. So excited. They've got other colours. I'm just facing on the pink, but they have some really nice blues as well. Silvers, more kind of like decoration, more tree skirts. Those snowmen are cool. Look for fifteen. Yeah, I really like them. I know, I feel like I'm trying to get one of them. Yeah, they are cool actually. Oh, they're quite solid. 50 quid. Good, uh, mm, maybe. This aisle grounds me a bit more because it's Halloween before it's Christmas, but they do have some cool stuff. What have they got here? Ghost marshmallows. Oh, like little cake mix stuff. Door covers. Spiders. Oh, LED like candle thing. Got lights. That's quite cool actually. These like little glasses. I love these tablecloths as well. Cool little straws. Oh, these straws are cool. Even just for the bar actually. Because we've obviously got our bar in our garden. Pet dress up. Oh my god, I feel like I need one for Simba. Little pumpkin jumper or something. They're all quite good as well. They've got a bunch of like LED lights, which is like ideal for filming and stuff like that. Water speakers, which I feel like I always wanted. Okay, so let's dive into the bag. Um, I feel like it's only right to start with the Christmassy themed stuff first, so let's go with that because that's more exciting. Lastly, I got some gift bags and gift wrapping. Um, so I feel like, yes, it's a little bit early for stuff like this, but I am a student. I think people like sometimes forget that I am a uni student and I feel like I need to kind of prep for Christmas early because I don't always have the most amount of money. I'm going to put them away basically. So the first one I got is this one for a pound, which just says it's Christmas and it's got a a dog on it like a dog smiling with his tongue out. I think I might use this one for my boyfriend's presents because I always tend to get him like a funny kind of like cartoony one so I think I'm gonna get that one for him um, and then I also got this one which I really loved as well which has got glitter on it um, and it's just lots of presents um, and they had so many gift bags this year. I think again I did mention in the clips but I did a lot of gift boxes last year and that was a bad move on my part. I feel like they were not worth the money and they're selling them this year and I thought I'm just gonna go back to my route and get some hampers and gift bags in there so I've got those two for a pound each. I also picked up these ones so these are the free gift bags um, like the free pack for $1.99 and it comes with three different designs um, but I just love these. I felt like they looked really like bougie kind of like great gift Gatsby feels I don't know I just thought these would be nicer for the more mature people in my life you know like my nan um like family friends um things like that like I just thought these would be quite cool so I just loved the design I thought free for 199 was really really good I also decided to get just like a bottle bag as well because I feel like there's always going to be someone that I need to buy like a bottle of alcohol for for Christmas so I just got this one here it's just got like peace and joy on it it's just again like pink kind of like navy blue and gold and this was 79p I went a tiny bit crazy on the tissue paper just because I love using tissue paper and I do use wrapping paper quite often but something about tissue paper I just feel it looks really nice so I got this one here this is like a kind of like a rose gold pinky color this was a pound and it is a six pack and then I didn't get these in B&M but I did just want to share them with you because I just thought they were so nice um so I got them from TK Maxx and they are like really cute designed tissue paper um and again this one's like kind of like rose gold metallic with white and then this one here is snowflakes and I just really love it I think TK Maxx do like the best birthday cards like gift bags hampers things like that so I feel like this year I'm definitely going to be getting a lot of stuff from there but I just thought since I bought quite a lot of gift wrap for Christmas I had to include these because I thought you guys might quite like looking at them. Next I got some chocolatey sweet bits which actually aren't for me. These are going to be gifts um, if I can contain myself from not eating them anyway. First thing I got is a Terry chocolate orange and this one's got exploding popping candy in it. They only do these around Christmas time and I just feel like it's not really Christmas without Terry chocolate orange. I feel like they are such a Christmassy chocolate. I only ever eat them at Christmas as well and I love them so much so I got this one for a pound um, and then you guys would have seen from the clips I found some of these Mike and Ike's um, but they are cotton candy flavoured and they were just giving me all the American vibes. I am yet to go to America, I feel like I tell every person under the sun this because 
I'm basically trying to hint at someone to take me. Um, but I just love it. I love anything like that, like anything kind of like American candy themed, I think is so cool. I think you can make really cool hampers out of it. And I know that B&M do a lot of American um, like brands now, but I've never seen these in there before. And I just thought they were really cute. So for a pound, I decided to pick up these ones as well. Next, I decided to get something which is a little bit boring and it is just a deodorant because I needed a deodorant. It's just a sure one, like a 48 hour large one. and yeah just a little basic there that I needed I also got these which are a little bit more on the October theme um so these are Halloween cake home baking sprinkles um so there's like witches on brooms there is purple sprinkles green sprinkles and then like skull and crossbones and I just thought they were really really cool but only like a pound as well so an absolute bargain so I decided to get some of those and then the final thing I decided to get from B&M is just really nice little like mull kind of tea light holder sort of thing it's got a little handle on it it's hearted and it's pink and I just really liked it I just thought it would make a really really lovely gift um and it was only three pounds as well so decided to get one of those up so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please do remember to give it a big thumbs up and let me know down below in the comments your thoughts I am so 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 pleased with everything I managed to find in there and literally I'm in my Christmas feels I need a Christmas candle on like I've got an autumn one on at the minute but I just want Christmas now. I just want to wrap presents and just like feel festive and watch Christmassy films and it's literally my favourite time of year and I absolutely love it and I'm so excited to be doing lots of Christmassy content again this year. Hope you guys all have a lovely rest of the day and I'll see you all very very soon for another video. Bye!